Philip's son, nothing can save me now. Do all you can do to gain back control of Byzantium. I don't know how I can take care of myself. Don't you worry, young Philip. I will help you take back Constantinople. After all, you are the Latin Emperor now. Look here, these are all fake. I could even eat them. Why the bloody hell would anyone keep fake relics? Why don't you ask the Empress herself why she gave you fake ones? She most probably had the real ones too. And I need to see her myself again, I swear. I will kill that lying she-wolf Elena this time, cut her throat and gouge her eyes off in public. Sir, I've been keeping watch on her all this time. She's been in exile. I'm afraid she's now dead. She deserves to be dead. Anyway, I need her remains eaten by the dogs. Now, aren't you all supposed to go to Sicily? But remember, don't mess anything up. Only spy on what the people are up to. Andronicus, my son, it's been six months. We all thought you were dead. Well, I'm not dead. Still, there's so much I need to fix. You do know your father had just died. The church still denies him a proper burial. I buried him myself. And besides, didn't you dare go back to Nikea? Why? I disordered myself. Andronicus, do all your best now that you're emperor. Alright, but I don't know whose ghost you are. Whatever you do, get that coronation shield away. Hide it so that its location is only known to us Byzantines. I dreamt I saw a large tree come out of my chest, and from it four rivers came out, all pointing at one place. Osman, my boy, that dream meant you would control a vast empire from Constantinople. But you must take it first and crush the Romans. You're now at the right time for that. Their emperor Andronicus II is weak. His empire is dying. Thank you.